All new at 11 cries of not in my backyard echoing through Gaston County tonight. Dozens of residents are speaking out to county commissioners against a proposed lithium mine moving into the area. Many are concerned about the environmental impact and a disruption to everyday peace of mind. On the other hand, though, a small number of others showing support for the mine, saying it's a potential economic boost. WCNC Charlotte's Brianna Harper explains more about the idea and how it can impact the neighborhood. At tonight's Gaston County Commissioner's meeting, we heard the pros and the cons that some believe will emerge as a result of this lithium mine. Now, on the board, it didn't take a vote just yet or whether or not to approve the zoning change for this mine, but instead took this moment as a chance to hear the plan, hear the concerns, and then weigh the options. Dressed in red as a sign to stop. These protesters hoping to put a halt to the proposed lithium mine in Gaston County before it gets any closer to becoming a reality. And it's a livelihood. In many cases, there's many farms. Um, and, you know, this mine will take that away from them. Some of the concerns include potential water contamination, dust and noise, all things no one wants in the place they call home. We don't have to have this mine here because lithium is such an abundant uh, natural resource. You know, there's so many other ways to get it that are greener and cheaper. It's like, why can't we just invest in those? Yet during tonight's presentation, Piedmont Lithium explained their proposed investment could be a payoff to the community, creating high paying jobs in a much needed supply chain for battery energy. There's more lithium processing talent in Gaston County, English speaking, than anywhere else in the world. A few residents recognizing these pros. We're sitting on a gold mine, literally, quite literally, we're sitting on good dirt. I see the potential of a project like this. I'm going to embrace it. But the majority of others more concerned about the cons. They are willing to destroy people's lives, homes, and one of the most beautiful, peaceful areas in Gaston County for rechargeable batteries. Representatives for Piedmont explain they must go through a series of regulatory permit approvals to help diminish any poor environmental effects. But neighbors worry that may not be enough. Piedmont Lithium's proposal would risk contaminating water sources for thousands throughout Gaston County for decades to come. And the next step is for Piedmont Lithium to apply for a state mining permit next month. And we're told they also plan to hold several other town halls and small group meetings in the near future. Reporting in Gaston County, Brianna Harper, WCNC, Charlotte.